what's up y'all welcome back to my channel my name is shamanique today i'll be taking you guys on the road with me but before i do so i just want to wish you guys a happy 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 2021 i know last year was a whole bunch of everything <laughs> but i pray that this year 2021 you know be a, a year of blessings a year of abundance for each and every one of you watching this video so a few days ago i turned the age of 30, like, yes, 30. <laughs> uh, I'm excited to say that now, but a few months ago, I would say, I was really dreading turning the age of 30 because, you know, I felt like I didn't have everything accomplished that I had set out to reach or accomplish before the age of 30. Um, but, you know, speaking to my Heavenly Father and Him showing me different stories and different people in the Bible who didn't start things be until the age of 30. He spoke to me about the story of Joseph when he was 17 years old. He was sold into slavery by his brothers. And he was favored by the Pharaoh, you know, to, to be ruler over Egypt. He spoke to me about Ezekiel. Ezekiel was 30 years old when he started his ministry. Jesus himself was 30 years old when he started his ministry. John the Baptist was 30 years old when he started his ministry. And I'm just like, Lord, look at this. What are you trying to say, Lord? You know, and he just said, daughter, you need to embrace it. Embrace 30, you know, and I have made a shirt that says embracing 30. I want the world to know that even, even though, you know, I don't have certain things accomplished that I have set myself out to accomplish by the age of 30. And I know there's many of many people out there who have set or made plans to accomplish certain things by the age of 30. But I just want to let you know that the things that God has planned for you, <laughs> the things that God has planned for you is going to blow your mind because I just feel so much joy in my spirit that even though I didn't have certain have I didn't accomplish certain things that I set out in my mind or in my plans to accomplish by the age of 30. I know and I have faith and I believe and I have so much peace knowing that my Heavenly Father is going to supersede everything that was on the list. <laughs> God is just so good. And I just want, I want someone to be encouraged today that if you're at the age of 29 about to turn 30, don't dread turning the age of 30 because you don't have or you haven't accomplished those things that you set out to accomplish because God is going to supersede those things, those very things just embrace the age of 30. So today I'll be taking you guys on the road with me. I'm going to Ulta right now um, to get some face necessities because mine are almost done. I use uh, Mary, Mar uh, Mario <laughs> Mario Badescu. I, I really love their, um, their line because I have very sensitive skin and um, that has been working well for me. I've been using it about six months now, but I just want to shout out my best friend uh, and I'll link her, I'll link her, um, YouTube also in the description below so you guys can check her out and follow her. Um, but yeah, shout out to her for getting me a gift card for my birthday <laughs> to Ulta because she knows I really, really need it. But I thank you guys. I'm going on the road now. All right, guys. So I just came out of Ulta, Ulta Beauty, and um, I'll show you guys what I got. So this is my little Ulta bag. Or whatever <laughs> so as I told you guys previously um, I love Mario Badescu and this is Mario Badescu's um, Amazon cleansing gel it's eight ounces and I'll show you guys I love 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 their line and this is for all types of skin the other thing I got was um, the oil free moisturizer it's two ounces it's a little pricey, but uh, well worth it. <laughs> I've been using this six months now. And both of these products six months now. And I tell you, it has blessed me. Blessed me in so many ways. Um, so yeah, that's my little, uh, my little trip to Ulta. I'm trying to figure out where I'm going to go next. Um, so as you guys can see, like I cut my hair. And you guys can see my little curls or whatever. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. But yeah, I, I cut my hair, so I'm embarking on this natural journey, um, which I'm very happy about because, you know, I'm no longer stressing over my hair because my hair is short now. Um, but I, I wash my hair once a week and I use natural, uh, you know, clean products now. My shampoos are paraben-free, sulfur-free, all those things. But I'm definitely excited about this journey. 
um, you know, I think this, this kind of helps me to, you know, take time out for me. So I'm definitely excited about that, um, to bring you guys along on the journey with me. So I'm interested to know, how is everyone's New Year's going? What are your plans for the New Year's? Um, you know, what are some changes that you're going to make this year compared to last year? Um, leave them in the comments below, and I, I pray that you guys have a blessed week. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll talk to you guys later. See you guys in the next video.